Andy, what's your thoughts? Uh, mixed. Do you know, I, th- I think first half we definitely controlled the game and I thought we were much better side in the first half and they've had one shot at goal and scored and we know ourselves it was a stupid goal to lose. We've let the boy dance through and get a shot away when someone said what we've done for the full 44 minutes before that is defend perfectly. But uh, second half, obviously, they looked like they controlled the game, but we still had a lot of breakaways, we were counting well. And then I still think we edged it overall, but a draw, you can't really be disappointed with a draw away at an SPL side. You did boss that first half and came out the traps flying? Yeah, came out the traps. Well, that's the kind of form we've been in recently. I know I've obviously been on the bench, but it just shows you the strength we've got that I feel that like I've stepped in and I've played my part today as well. And uh, but it's, it's easy to come into a team that's doing well. That's the main thing. And uh, Dob scored him again, as he does. And I think everyone can be happy with the performance today. I'm pretty sure at half time you'd be wondering how it was 1 1. Yeah, well, we're disappointed. It kind of knocks the stuffing out of you a wee bit and gives them something to hold on to coming into the second half. Whereas we go into the second half 1 0 up. I think it could have been a different game. But it's one of those things, and we've just got to. Get on with us. We've got another game against Partick, obviously a big game in the league, and then the replay will take care of itself. You can take confidence from the fact that you have come here mm-hmm. and taken something to probably match them or more than match them yeah. at points. I think we did as well. I think if you first half, I thought we were the better side. Second half, you could see they had a lot more of the ball and they were, they were pushing forward a lot more. But as I said, we were breaking well and we've probably had the better chances in the second half. We were in there. I think I don't think Aldo had a save to make. And it just shows you, like apart from their goal, if you take that away, what's Aldo had to do? And I think for all the ball they had, they never created anything. And for the little ball we had, we've created the best chances. Should you say a replay down in, at Palmerston? They won't fancy coming down there. No, they, obviously not. I don't think anyone fancies coming down there when they see the form we're in. And especially, we're not really focused on that game. That game will take care of itself when it comes. We've got Partick next and that's... The next game is always the most important, especially with the league position we're in and how fragile the league can be. You're only six, nine points off the top, but there's also your six points off, God knows, people at the third bottom. So the next game is obviously the most important and we'll take care of the replay when it comes about. You are going into that game in a good run of form, though, so nothing to fear going nothing to Nothing to fear, of course. And I was looking forward to seeing Big Jibsy, but he was obviously not going to be there, is he? <laughs> but... Uh, for all their league position says it, it doesn't say a lot about them every time we've played them I thought they've been really good they just can't obviously buy a win now so we're not going to expect them to roll over we know exactly what we're going to get and out of their patch and especially with all the players they've brought in they'll be a wee lift about the place but we just got to go and see what happens You want to go there to get another three points on the board continue this run of oh, You go to every game in this league to win you know, you'd never go to a game not to win so going to go there especially the former in so you've got a bit of confidence and training's good and the boys are happy it's easy it's just you you can't wait for the next game that's the kind of mood everyone's in just now